Hi viewers, welcome you all, to my channel. My name is Summit. How are you all of you? In last video we discuss about the introduction of BMS and who are the manufacturers of BMS. I hope all of you understand well. Today's video we will discuss about the overview of the field devices used in BMS so, let's get started. Before you know about field devices, you need to understand, where they are used. First, AHU as abbreviation, Air Handling Unit. Second, FCU abbreviation as Fan Coil Unit. Third, VAV abbreviation as Variable Air Volume. Fourth, Chiller, which we write IT as CH and Chilled Water System as CHW. These all you will know about upcoming videos, we will talk about in detail. 5th, PMP abbreviation is pumps. 6th, CT. Abbreviation is cooling tower. Now take a look of some of the field devices which are commonly used in any projects. Such as temperature sensor. On right side you can see the specifications of field devices. This is the product of Johnson Control. This is an air temperature sensor. It is sensing the temperature inside the duct, outside temperature and even it can mount in a wall also. There are many types of sensor resistance available in the market such as nickel, platinum, thermistor and NTC. 22 org, wire is acceptable as per standard protocol. Second, this is the product of Johnson Control. This is called as damper actuator, this is used to control the damper such as fresh air, return air, mix air or supply air damper. Depends upon the sequence. This is a modulating type damper, means it is work between 0 to 100%. It is taking 24 volt AC, constant power and for modulating 0 to 10 VDC or 4 to 20 milliampere. This actuator give feedback in DC volts. Third, this is also a damper actuator, but the manufacturer is different. Manufacturer name is Belimo. This on slash off type actuator. As you can see, control type is floating slash three. Point. Means one point is for common, second for open and third for close. These all specifications, I will discuss with you details in future videos. Fourth, this is also a damper actuator from Siemens. But, there is a minor difference in this actuator. As you can see, it is written 2 point, means only power 230 volt AC, only apply on it. That means this damper actuator is using as a fire damper actuator. And major point is, it is having a spring return function, means when any emergency happen, it will close the damper immediately. Fifth, differential pressure switch also called as DPS this is the product of Greystone. This field device is used for sensing pressure or sensing airflow. When there is no flow, it will give a dry contact signal to controller and the equipment will stop immediately. Sixth, differential pressure transmitter also called as DPT this is the product of Cetra. The only difference between DPS and DPT are, DPT giving analog signal and DPS giving binary signal. Seventh, room thermostat this is the product of Johnson controls. It is sensing the room temperature and humidity. You can change set point and as per the set point, it is giving signal to FCU, VAV or AHU. For better understanding, look the example on the screen. This is called as AHU as an air handling unit. You can see, all field devices are circle. These three are damper actuator. 
first installed in the fresh air, second in return air and third is installed in valve actuator. This is DPS, differential pressure switch, installed in return line. This is flow sensor. This is temperature and humidity sensor. It will sense, temperature and humidity inside the duct. Hi viewers, this is the end of this video. In next video, we will try to provide you more knowledgeable and more interesting concept. If you have any question, drop it in comment box. Please like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.